this is true. Welcome to my channel. Hope you're having a very nice day wherever you are. And if you'd like to subscribe to the channel, like the video, and feel free to comment. I love to read comments. And at the end, of course, somewhere down there when you comment, I'd like to know if you tried one of these before. So it's the Jimmy John's New Spicy East Coast Italian Sandwich. Okay, truthfully, this came out back in, in August was when they released it, but it's supposed to be a permanent menu item. It's not a limited time thing. So relatively speaking, if it's going to be on the menu for maybe years, then it's still kind of new. Before we get into this, though, I want to give kind of a, a shout out of appreciation to a very fine ASM artist named Salted Caramel ASMR. She goes by Katie. It's probably some complicated Greek name. She's from Greece. That would probably be embarrassed trying to pronounce, as my Greek is not very good. But I must tell you that there are three alphabets that I know. One is English. I can recite the German alphabet. And when I was 13 or 14, I recited the Greek alphabet from Alpha to Omega. I don't know why. I'm not going to burden you with it now. I thought about it, but I don't want to be like I'm showing off. But anyway, as usual, I, I got around the subject. This lady, Salted Caramel ASMR, she gave me a shout out on her 90,000th subscription celebration. Did she put me down in the description or with a little link? No. Did she put me at the end of the video? No. She put me up at the very, almost the very beginning of the video in one minute, just after one minute of her 90,000 celebration video. She said some really kind things about me. And if you watch her, I, I invite everyone to go to her channel. And if you invite, if you watch her videos, it's just so positive and bright and, 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 and what, oh, just, just a gracious, endearing, lovely lady. And she does such great food, dining, AS, ASMR as I, I don't know how she, how she does that. But she's just so wonderful that it wouldn't matter to me what she was doing. If she was, if she was trying to sell car parts online, if she was uh, talking about bathroom detergents or dishwasher liquids, I wouldn't care. It's just her, her voice. And she speaks such good English, better than I do, really. So, love you, Katie. Now let's get to our little sandwich for the day. Jimmy John's Spicy East Coast Italian. So, take it from all different sides here, okay? And we've only added about five or six permanent items to the menu this year. And online, I saw this was supposed to be a seven inch sub, but when I got to the Jimmy John's, they said it was an 8-inch sub. Okay, good. And this cost $5.95 before tax. $5.95. So, let's go ahead and check this out. See what we got in there. Ooh la la. 
<laughs> this is going to be great. Well, here's Mr. Pumpkin. Say hi to him. Can you tell us apart? I'm going to cut this in half. Yes. I can see that already. using these paper plates. I'm not using the fine china like I used to because it makes too much noise if I'm trying to, to cut something up. So, do you miss the china? I mean, I do. And I'm sure I'll have it again. Oh gee, I haven't even got this thing cut in half yet. There we go. Okay. Let you see this a little bit better now. Here's the cross section of it. Okay. And this has natural double Genoa salami, double capicola, and double provolone cheese. And then it's topped with tomato lettuce, a sliced onion, sauce, and hot cherry peppers. Let's take a look inside. There we are. You can see those onions there and, and that special sauce, uh, the, the uh, salami. There's our cheese here on the bottom. Yay. Provolone cheese. I think that was two slices. It said double. And by the way, this uh, is supposed to have mayonnaise on it. I told them no mayonnaise. This channel is mostly a mayonnaise free zone. It's just like cheese people, you know, the fast food places, they throw the cheese and the mayonnaise on there. But to me, it detracts from the taste. A little bit about the capricola. It's a kind of a, an Italian meat. It's uh, the workers, uh, people in Italy eat it. It's frequently used for like lunch meat on sandwiches or in dishes like pasta. So it's coated with a kind of a black pepper or a hot red pepper powder. Okay, I'm talking too much. Let's get into it. the games begin. Mmm. Salami is good. Mayonnaise. Bad. Tarzan not like mayonnaise. There's a tomato, tomato, depending on how you wish to pronounce it. Mm. I love this. There's a lot of salami on this sandwich. As I said, it was doubled up. It, it, it has a good flavor, a, a good taste to it. Very natural. the bread to gelata. Can you 
nutrition wise these are supposed to have about 1100 calories around that and it's like 3300 milligrams of sodium pretty good bit there 59 grams of fat something like that see why this would be a working man sandwich. It's a pretty formidable sandwich. Plenty of calories. have had my, my iced tea and just ice water, instead of ice water, but I wanted to see how the, I really wanted to get the natural taste of it, but I thought that it would be hotter. If it's supposed to, if it has spicy in the name, then it seemed like it would be hotter, but I, I really don't taste a lot of, a lot of heat coming from this, you know. didn't I ask for spicy mustard? Why? I always ask for that. And I just got there and I just completely skipped my mind. That makes me so mad that I forgot the mustard. They asked me if I wanted everything that goes on it normally. I said, yes, okay, but uh, except mayonnaise, and there's no mayonnaise here, just the sauce, that's good. But I didn't think about the spicy mustard. definitely save this one till later. So a great sandwich. I wish I hadn't forgotten the spicy mustard. I have some some kind of mustard, I think, somewhere in the refrigerator. When I finish this video, I'll make it find it. <laughs> I hope you're having a very good day and that you had a good weekend. It's getting a little bit cooler here now. Still no rain, we're in the middle of a drought. But anyhow, I wish you all the best and and I really recommend this sandwich. I really love it. Even without the spicy mustard. Still good. This is a trip. I'm gonna tell you, peace out.